Hello guys, welcome back again. Hope you are doing well. I am MJ. In this video, I will show you how to properly factory search MacBook and how to set up it again. So watch this video very carefully, okay? So by doing factory research, we will lead all data from your MacBook, okay? So doing the factory research will erase all your setting, your content, your data from the MacBook. So if you have any important data in your MacBook, then take the backup, okay? So if you have any important data in your MacBook, take the backup, okay? After this, uh, go to setting and then select the journal, click on journal. Let me uh, zoom in. Yep. Now click on transfer and transfer or reset. So click the transfer or reset. So here you will get the option erase all content and setting. That means it will delete all data including the partition of your MacBook. So click on all data erase and then type your passcode and unlock and it's also erase your all touch id and accessories so again i'm telling this will delete all your data so be careful if you have any important data then take the backup and these are final step click on erase all and after this your macbook will restart and it will set to factory reset so your MacBook might be restart several times, so don't be panicked, sit back, relax. So again, I'm telling if you have any important data, then take the backup before you're going to factory reset. Okay, setup is complete now. It's time to activate your Mac. If you want to activate later, you can click on restart or next. But I want to activate uh, right now. So select the Wi-Fi or if you have uh, a hotspot, then select it and insert the Wi-Fi or hotspot password. Click on join. And after this, your Mac uh, will be a restart. So this is a setup processing. Okay. So let's restart it. Okay. So this is a welcome screen. So this process is for setup. So we have set the factory set the MacBook. Now it's time to uh, set up the MacBook. So you are welcome screen and now select your language. Okay. And then uh, select the your country or region. Click continue. Okay, preferred language English, input source uh, right, dictation, dictation is also right. Okay, everything is fine. Click continue. And accessibility, so I don't want to set up anything right now. So I'll click not now. Okay, Wi-Fi. So if you want, you can uh, connect to the Wi-Fi. Let me zoom in. Okay. Yep. So uh, select the your Wi-Fi and then uh, type the password. Click on continue. Okay. Okay. Data and privacy. Click continue. Um, Migration, I don't want to uh, uh, input or uh, restore any data from the MacBook or from the PC. So I will select not now. So if you have already uh, take the backup of the MacBook, then only you can uh, restore from the MacBook. So I'm going to take the not now. Yeah. So sign in with your Apple ID. If you don't have the your Apple ID, then create the new Apple ID. Or if you want, you can set up uh, your Apple ID later. So you can click on this setup later. But I have an Apple ID already. So here simply uh, type your Apple ID and password. Okay. Or if you, if you want, you can set up it later. 
but apple id is must and should to use the macbook so i'm going to tap the apple id and password and after this you will get the verification code to other devices which is running the uh, same apple id so type the uh, code that on the macbook click continue and it's time to give the your uh, computer name okay and give the password yep type the same password once again and click continue uh, location i don't want don't want to enable the location right now so uncheck location and continue okay select the don't use yeah select the time zone these are important so select the correct time zone so first select your country here like this point out your country and then select the your uh, city or closest city or nearest city okay uh, select it so select your city or nearest city and then continue uh, analytics i don't want to share so uncheck and continue uh screen time uh, i don't need it so i'm going to take the setup later if you want you can set up it i will take setup later uh siri uh, i enable uh, later okay so i'm going to uncheck the uh, siri right now so i'm going to disable the uh, siri and continue so you can uh, enable all this thing later okay uh touch id yeah i will set up later so click on setup touch id later yes continue okay now uh, select the theme this is the light theme and uh, let me check the dark okay yeah it looks nice and the auto okay i will take the dark so it's up to you you can select any uh, theme and then continue and that's it so we have successfully factory reset and set up the macbook now a uh, first thing update your macbook macbook if any update is available then uh, check the update and update your macbook and now you can uh, set up your touch id uh, and you can uh, set up your ipad id also so you need to sign in with your ipad id so as i said uh, doing the factory reset will read everything from your macbook so take the backup if you have imported data in your macbook before you going to reset and after this uh, after setup complete you can set up your apple id you can sign in with your apple id also yeah this is the way to factory reset and set up macbook so thank you for watching guys catch you next video please like share and subscribe thank you very much